All right, guys, on today's episode of A Curated Collection, we have five neo-vintage and vintage-era dress watches that are all 3K or under that I think are great additions to dress up a collection in your wrist. So let's take a closer look at the three brands within these five watches and why I think these are some of the best value props for under $3,000. So before we start, as always, all the watches that we're taking a look at today are available over at the Vintage Watch Shop at HuntingtonCompany.com. So if any of these catch your eye or interest you, make sure you check it out, link in the bio. Out of the five, let's take a look at the most affordable option first, which is a super popular watch as of recent, the Softwatch Salvador Dali. This is the smaller case size, which is not much smaller than the large, and I think it actually wears better on a normal to smaller size wrist. In my opinion, the simple Roman dial and this dolly style case is super cool and for under two thousand dollars i don't think you're getting anything as quirky and unique as this also for a cartier crash alternative for well under two thousand dollars i don't think you're going to beat it knowing that the original cartier crashes go for a quarter of a million dollars now the smaller size of the salvador dolly watch also wears more like the original cartier crash so if that's something that you're truly interested in when it comes to case size i would say go for this size and not the larger one this one is paired with an aftermarket strap but it does have its original buckle and it comes in amazing condition with no crazy wear on the case and the crystal is still all intact so if you're looking for a soft watch salvador dolly this one is available right now over at huntingtoncompany.com then we step up to right under two thousand dollars this moose d cartier tank is in amazing condition with zero spidering on the dial it's paired with its original strap and buckle it has some oxidization on the hands but nothing too major the case and dial are in amazing condition. This is a perfect start for anybody looking to get into Cartier. Now, as of recent, there's a lot of hate on the Moose D Cartier tanks because they are gold plated and they do have just a simple edda movement. But you have to understand, a Tank Louis cost eight to 10 grand in the same case size with a solid gold case and either a JLC, AP, or Piaget movement housed inside. For under $2,000, that's less than one fourth of the cost of an actual Tank Louis, you can get yourself a Cartier tank that is by Cartier has the same case size and design elements. You can start your Cartier collection with an affordable alternative, but it's still from the same brand, which is amazing. So again, if you're looking to get into Cartier, but don't want to spend thousands of dollars on their actual Cartier tank, Louise and Santos's and so on, take a look at the vintage Moose de Cartier line. Cause in my opinion, they are still one of the coolest watches for under $2,000. And then lastly, we have three of the same models which is the Audemars Piguet Ultra Slim, also known as the Classique or the AP Calatrava. This AP is in a 31 to 32 millimeter case. We have three examples, three totally different variations, but we'll take a look at the most affordable coming in at $2,800. We have one of the earlier series and we know that because first it is a C serial. Second, you can see it has a more bubble case back to it. This one has a simple stick configuration for the hands and hour markers, a champagne dial and yellow gold case. These watches are some of my favorite to source because for well under $5,000, you're getting yourself a watch from the Holy Trinity in precious metal. And at the end of the day, it is an Audemars Piguet and it is one of the cleanest designs, in my opinion, for a dress watch. So this is the first example. Then we step to the $3,000 price point and we take a look at the point edge bezel, also in yellow gold. You can see this is a later model with its flat case back. Its coin edge bezel, I think, makes it wear just a little bit larger. This one does come with its original strap and buckle, which are also in great condition, knowing that this is 50 years old now. These APs are beautiful and with a Roman dial like this and a single and blasted finished example. I think you get a lot for the money that you're spending. Again, this is Audemars Piguet for under $5,000. And lastly, my personal favorite, this rose gold lacquer dial in gloss white with its original rose gold buckle. Also with the slim case back being a later model, this one a D serial. You can see some oxidization on the hands, but nothing too crazy. I think it gives the watch a bit of character in that rose gold case with its gloss lacquer dial. 
style, I think pair perfectly. Again, all these watches could be dressed up as well as dressed down, which is the best part of dress watches. A lot of people think that a dress watch is only for formal events, but just as you would wear a Rolex Datejust, I think you can wear an Audemars Piguet Ultra Slim, a Cartier Tank, or that super unique Salvador Dali soft watch. So if you're looking to spice up your collection, change it up a bit, and want something a bit more dressy and classic, take a look at these five Neo Vintage and Vintage dress watches over at HuntingtonCompany.com. I personally love all three of these models. I'd love to chat with you. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. And thank you guys so much, as always, for checking out today's video.